Hello everyone, welcome back. Unturned Isle of Wolves 3. We're out front of the base here where we left off, but before we get going, I want to show you guys another mod that I downloaded. This is another mod from Pugo, the same person who made this bunny hopper. You see these little packs on here? Look at this. So there's a store. I got a storage pack on the back there. There's a little duffel up top that you can put stuff. I got one over here on this door here that you can put stuff in. So this is pretty neat, you guys. Check these out. So here's the bags here. You've got a saddlebag pouch. You've also got a duffel as well as a medium saddlebag, a large saddlebag, and an extra large saddlebag. So these are like vehicle pouches, right? So I've got a, I've got a truck here. Let's take a look and see what we can do with this. Let's take the largest one and see how this works. So this one, like a nice large one like this, we can put on the back here. Look at that. So just like you guys were saying, with putting like the, you know, the storage container on there and having that big thing, this is like a way better way of doing the same thing. But you can get multiples on here. Look at the size of the storage in this. Lar this is the extra large one. That's the extra large one. Let's see about the large. So we can maybe put one on the side here. So if you had two of these bad boys, you could put one on each side on these trucks. That's a, a little bit smaller. You know, this is the large, this is the extra large one. But look at the size. Imagine all the storage you guys could haul around with that. Again, Pugo's World is on the Steam Workshop. And then what else do we have? We have the medium size. Let's equip that. We put a medium size one back here. So you got medium, large, extra large. Again, a little bit smaller. What else do we have? So here's a, a duffel, a duffel bag. Let's see where you could put it in the window. You could put it on the front. Let's put it in this window over here. So it's it like it's designed. It's like hanging off your window there. And that duffel, look at the duffel though. It, the duffel's got pretty good storage as well. That's almost like an extra large. Well. Huh, it's it's so it's it's in between the the extra large and the large it looks like good storage so even two of the saddlebags would be really good and then finally we've got this small pouch Let's see where we can put the pouch at you can put it on the window looks like put it on the hood if you can put it oh look at this put it right up top now it's really small so I don't know if that one is Maybe if you have a really small vehicle, that one might not be worth crafting there. So I've got, I'm going to take this one off here. Oh, I had, oops, I had magazine there. I'm going to take this one off. I want to put that extra large one on my vehicle. Right on the back here. So you can put it, kind of push it in wherever you want. All right, now I got to put all this stuff back in because I want to... Oh, no! I wanted to keep this stuff. No, don't do that. I got to pull forward a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> Neener, give me all this stuff. And I put it in my new bag here. All right, so we've got these. We've got these military mags. Tracers. A lot of room in that one. Look at all the room in that. I really like that one. I like that one. This is, uh, you know, I'm thinking about, let's take this stuff out of here. Let's get rid of this guy. Put this one over here. I want to take this duffel off this one. Because this duffel's a good size. So, like like I said, that big one there, maybe, maybe some of these duffels. Put it right there. Look at that. Put that in there and that in there. Perfect. So we got the little guy up top. I think they're awesome, man. I think it's a great idea. Drop that on the ground. But now you can see some of the options you can do with your vehicle. So these are pretty easily made. The recipe is in the description of the mod, as well as the ID numbers to get these things. So that being said, it's time to push in and place them unturned. 
get the oh they've respawned since I they've respawned since I came in here last come on down there. all right we know what we looked in these tents already we're, we're going over oh we got some looks like some humvees under construction Dude, fire down there Yeah, definitely got some Humvees under construction in this place. Okay. Looking for loot. We got gas tank, gas cans, more vests, plenty of loot. I love it. I love it when there's a lot of loot. Ah, they came out of the woodwork, dude. Reload. Reload. They really like me. See ya! All right, we're doing good. That guy's like, you wanna come back in here with me? <laughs> no, not really, no. Look at these. It's like a six wheel. Oh, there's a battery right there, nice. Let's grab that battery. Might need that. Might need that battery. More gas cans. So if you see a lot of gas cans, remember, you want to collect those gas cans because I think when you get about five or so of them together, you can make the industrial can. I think it's five or seven. Oh, yeah. You know what? Now that we've got some... Uh, we got to check these, though, for... Okay, they're both empty. Did we see a tank around here? It's not that kind of tank. I'm in a gas tank. Ooh. The gas can. All right, so cap lock, de-equips. De-equips whatever's in your hand. Another battery. Battery! All right, you crazy military zombies. This is a nice base. It's got, like, different sections. You can see that's like, whoa, there is a lot of dudes over there. There's a lot of dudes over there. Huh. Uh -uh. Look at the, the way they, their tanks lined up. It's like a line of, uh, what do they call that? Assembly line. Assembly line of tankage. See what's up top. What do you got going for us, friend? GPS, nice. Ooh, the Desert Falcon. That's a, that's a Desert Eagle, like a fitty. A fitty cow. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go put this. I got a couple of gas cans. I'm gonna go put them back into our little duffel bags. Now, if I look at this, if we take a quick look at this. Uh, crafting. See, all right. So it takes five portable gas cans and your blowtorch to make the industrial one, which is nice. Like if you're gonna carry one around, you might as well carry the industrial one around. So we can find a couple more along the way. Uh, that would be good. Just two, we just need two more for that. But look at that, all that storage capabilities, storage space. We're gonna make quick work of this base and I wanna head over to the Ranger headquarters, see what they're doing over there. You stupid zombies. I think next episode we'll move on and spotlight some more guns because I really like this Scar L though. I really like this. The sound of it is so good. Fire's not bad. Whoa, that dude just did a... It's like from an action movie. Did you see that? A little flipperino. Whoa. Oh. These guys are tough. Tough as nails. What did he drop? Sabertooth. Oh, another scar. There's the standard scar. Yeah! Headshot. Go straight to the fire range, show these guys how to shoot. I see ya. Hey, I'm busy. Sighting in my rifle. Yes. There's the falcon. Okay, saber tooth. What else you guys drop here? Come on. Show me the money. Oh. Get invisible, dude. There's always... Reload! Reload believer. Why don't you guys drop me some military ammo crates, please? I 
could really use some ammo crates. GPS and a spring. What do you got in here? Oh, it's like the... Oh, yeah. Nice. The gun shop. Grenade! I love grenades. Alright. Helmet MRE. MREs are delicious. <laughs> Suppressor. I gotta... Oh, there's uh, the good... The good ammo. Vertical grip. Nice. You know what I didn't try? Okay, so look. You can put... You can mod onto this the vertical grips and... And all the other stuff too. So if it's if it's designed to fit that particular gun, you can put it on here. Ear earpiece, earpiece. You have an earpiece. Military knife, spring, barrel. I don't want to put any kind of barrel on here because the idea of this barrel looking the way it looks, you know, you want to see your gun look awesome. So I leave that like it is. I thought that was a dude over there. All right, last little area here. Oh. Yeah, you just got scarred, son. Mad kit. I think I heard somebody. Yep, I did. I knocked his shirt right off him. <laughs> what happened, man? Why well, you got no shirt on, dude? Did you just get shot. Grenade. Knife, knife, knife. 16 times scope. So I got an 8 times scope in the in the vehicle. Now we have 16 times scopes. Now if we run out of ammo again. I've been saving the uh, I've been saving the magazines. <clears throat> we got a Humvee. Oh dude. The Humvee with those backpacks would be awesome. Can we get it out of here though? We got a uh, AC-130 in there, Spectre gunship. I know they have the gate down here. I wonder if there's a way we can jump this bad boy out of here. It is a Humvee after all. Imagine the Humvee all decked out and geared out with all the, uh, with all the bags on it. I think we can fit through here. I think that the military miscalculated their gate. <laughs> Dude, the Humvee with all the packs on it. Oh my gosh. It would be awesome. What is this one? Large one. All right. There. Like this one. I think this is another large one. Put it in this window. Eh, people in the back seat, they don't need to see anyway. Okay, there and there. Dude, that looks so cool. Grab this one. So we can put up. I want to see a lot of them want to sit in these little windows here, and then on the front, and then on the hood, on the the roof too. You actually look at that. You can put a couple on the roof because that one's gonna go there. I bet you I can put this one up there too. Put it right in the front. <laughs> look at that. It's fully decked out, you guys. Look at all this storage space. I mean, you can easily jump up on here to get the storage space to these things, but all of that storage space on this Humvee. All right, we'll leave our buggy here. We'll take the Humvee over and check out this. There should be a, a ranger place over here. Maybe they'll let us in. They're like, oh, here comes the military dude. He's got all the, the duffel bags hanging off his Humvee. He's okay to come through. Dude, maybe we should have taken the buggy. This looks rough. AC-130, gunship! Yeah, this thing's awesome. I think we need to go over here. You're doing buggy. Ah, no! No, 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 no. Humvee's not good on site. Oh, there it is. I can see it. Look at that place. Oh, it's like a fortress. Can you drive through this? Yes, you can. Oh, look at that. Oh, my gosh. You know they're going to be waiting. I got to go. Oh. I'm gonna have to go back to get my buggy anyway, so turn this bad boy around. Wow, dude! Holy cow! Look at the amount of damage that does! Hold on! Hold on, Humvee! I'll save you! I did not realize how much damage it does going through those. I just watched that last one, it was down to 10%. Oh, dude. 
oh, these guys got these guys are like spec ops, man. These, this is Ranger headquarters. They got balaclavas on, man. They're wearing face mask. <laughs> Look at, oh, <laughs> yeah. But you weren't expecting to do with a scar out here in four time scope. Oh, see ya. What the news? These guys are legit. Look at this base. It's like a FOB, a forward operating base. They got the fo the Ranger FOB up here, and they're all they're going all ooh, canteen nice. See, balaclavas here. Look at they're going all uh all native with the with the posts like old school fortress. Oh, he just dropped like a carrot or something. See ya. Dude's inside. Barf. The four times scope is nice. It's super nice. I mean, I really like the red dot, but if you're going to stand off, like, away from these dudes a little bit, you should really, uh, <laughs> really get yourself some magnification on your scope. There's another dude. Wowzers, dude. They've got a lot of dudes here. They're all, like, incognito, right? It's, uh, they're, they're watching their, they're watching their identity, you know? Spec Ops got to keep that old identity secret. Look at these guys all have the Rangers. You guys are nuts. Oh, don't mind if I do get a Snapskerskaya. AK for days. You like the AK. All right. Got a, oh, tomato. Somebody's eating healthy. Someone's eating healthy. Get myself a little bit of water. Can soda. Don't mind if I do. Oh, umbrella. Need that. Definitely. There's a dude right down here. There's a dude just sitting out there. Chainsaw! Cobra sight. Perfect for the uh, yellow umbrella. Actually, I might want the yellow umbrella. There's the AK, actually, right there. The other one, I... Oh, that's the... That's like the SVD. That's like the SVD. Uh, I'll drop this, and... <clears throat> should be able to pick this up. There we go. Oh, my gosh! That's an RPG! Dude! Dude! We got an RPG! Hold on! Friends! Must get to vehicle for storage space. I need that RPG. Remember, I found a rocket up. Uh, I found a rocket up there at the Bravo base. <clears throat> All right, let's uh, that, 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 and that. Okay, there we can move a lot of this stuff out of here. Just want our space, man. There we go. Oh, I want that so bad. There we go. There we go. There we go. Oh, we're getting low on ammos. We're about done with the old uh, Scar. All right. We got to get that. <clears throat> we got to get that. So I got some other gun mods to show you guys. Pretty cool stuff. Haven't tested them out yet, but uh, we'll do that together. Okay. Somebody is sleeping with their gun, which makes sense. Total sense. Take that. Potato. All right, we need to get that R to the P to the G. Oh, dude. Rocket launcher time. Look at that thing. Oh, it's so good. <laughs> yeah, see ya. That little crawler dude back here had a tomato. Tomato. <clears throat> I've used an RPG in this thing. A lot of binoculars. Seems they've got uh, they've got a lot of hand tools too. I think they're having to make all these this uh, this stuff here. Oh, is this like a super secret way to get in? Oh, sneak in the back of the bait. That's another rocket launcher. I got one already. There was two rocket. Whoever is whoever's room that is, they're pretty serious about blowing things up. I gotta see where that other rocket launcher was. Oh, it's hiding behind it. Look at that. Don't you hide behind it. What do you need a planner for, dude? 
A planner box. Oh, you know what we're gonna do? Let's drive. Let's drive back over to. Let's drive back over to do. Oh, I kind of want to take this vehicle, but it's kind of a long way back. Let's say, I'll drive back over to our vehicle, right? And blow this one up with the RPG if we can. <laughs> I don't know if that's a good idea, Meaty. If we can get back there, because this uh, side cliff here. Okay, so 15% damage from hitting one one little fence. One little fence. I have a feeling I'm going to roll this thing. We're a bit top heavy now. Oh, no. No. Dune buggy, I'm coming for you. I got to take my stuff out of here, though, right? Well, I don't need all this stuff. I just need the essentials. The... The, gu the couple, yeah, one, one or two. Oh, that's a tree. One or two guns. Okay, so there's our buggy. We'll put this thing right about here. Let's see, what do we need out of this? Uh, if we take this and this, I thought maybe I could use that. Let's just equip and use that thing. Mad kit. All right, we don't need that. Um, you know what? I'm just gonna blow this thing up right now. Oh, I almost forgot this though. I do need that. Let's take that stuff. Don't have anything in there. We're gonna see the durability that is this vehicle. Sure. I wanted that. Yeah, the coat. We need the Cobra sight. A couple grenades and our 16 times scope. That's all we needed. Yeah, we're good. We're good. Neener, 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 neener. All right. Let's equip said rocket launcher. <laughs> Whoa, dude, the Humvee took it. Oh, I got a rocket in here. I have a rocket in... No, I have a rocket in my inventory? No. Where did I put that rocket? Right here. Oh, it's a missile. Is that not for the... Oh, it's not for this. What is the missile? Oh, you can put a... Dude, you can put an optic on this thing. Oh my gosh. That is crazy. Look, look at the optic on here. Not that you need it on this. It's like a, a shoot, shoot it and forget. I want to know what the, what the heck this missile goes to. Does it say... Legendary mag. Oh, it's for a tank. <laughs> Dude, I'm carrying around a tank rocket. What? What the dude? I was gonna shoot a tank rocket out of an RPG. Oh my gosh! All right, you guys, that's gonna do for this episode. We're gonna get regeared, get set up in another location, and we're gonna go for some new guns, some different guns. So again, in this, we checked out this military base here, and this military base called the Griffin Military Base, as well as the Ranger Headquarters. Shot an RPG, and we checked out these bags. I mean, these bags are totally... Actually, you know what? Look at that. So I shot it, and look, it blew up all the bags. You can see the gun sitting there. And it's down to 30 health, so that RPG blew up all those duffel bags. So if you got a vehicle equipped with a bunch of duffel bags, be careful. No one's shooting RPGs at you. All right, guys, don't forget to hit that like button. Leave me a comment down below. I will see you all in the next episode.